Hello and welcome to this video in which I will be showing you about Tangent Template software. Uh, many people have asked me what I use to create my low content books, which I publish on Amazon KDP. And although currently I use many different programs, Tangent Template was one of the very first ones I started using because um, several reasons. One, the simplicity is very easy and very fast to create um, low content books with uh, this software, but also because it was a one-off uh, fee that I had to pay a reasonably good price, $59, and I thought it was worth it, at least for me. Um, I will write the full address uh, until the video so that you can go and have a look by yourself. Just to let you know, this is not an affiliate link. Um, I don't believe, uh, believe tangent templates do affiliate, so I'm just showing you this because um, I found it very useful. So uh, I think to start with, it's pretty good. So uh, just to show you, so if you go to buy, um, it, oh, sorry, I was already logged in. So anyway, what it does is it shows you, you can, you can fill on your details. It's $59 and that's it. You, it's yours for life. So anyway, I, as I'm logged in, what I will do is very quickly, this is going to be very, very basic, so I can do more in detail um, at another, in another video. But for now, I just wanted to show very, uh, very some, uh, quick what this offers. So I believe they have about, they have about I don't know if it's 80 or 100, I think it's 100 ready-made templates uh, from really, really basic like this, like just rule like paper. Two other things, music sheets, and you can have calligraphy, uh, knitting, um, many other things. So you can choose from here, and it is as simple as the following. So if I go for the simplest of uh, all of them, um, the blue line paper, uh, this one you obviously choose your size that you want your book to be. So eight and a half by eleven inches, page, page count, let's say 120. And in this one, because um, they're always going to the lines are going to go from age to age. So it doesn't give you the option. It always has to be a bleed in here. But I will go into a different template to show you that you can choose. So what you do is you select all this and then you go to download interior and here it is. And it comes, it makes it into a PDF. So if we choose another one, let's choose one of these comic books. So if I choose that one, again, you obviously have to choose the size. So let's choose the same, eight and a half, page count, let's say 80. And in here, you can choose whether you want to put bleed or not. I always choose with bleed, but that's my personal preference. But in here, if you know that you're not going to go to the edges, then just choose no. And then download, and it takes a couple of seconds. And there you are. You have another book that you can uh, upload directly to Amazon KDP. Uh, it, they all download as PDFs, and I will do another video in which I will show you how you can make it into um, PowerPoint or Word or whatever other uh, software you want to use to perhaps add extras or modify any of the pages. But as I said, I will leave that one for a different video. So that is that simple. Um, and that is the ready-made templates that you find in here. And then if I scroll down we get to this dynamic templates they have the prompts and they have the planners if i get into the prompts and i'll show you very quickly what it is so say that we want to create a journal with motivational with iron motivational uh, prompts um, again what you do you choose your size you can choose the font that you want to choose i'm just going to perhaps choose um, Roboto, and then in here you can choose the size of uh, the font and you start 
created your prompt. So I am um, uh, creative. I am uh, strong. I am grateful. I'll just leave it like that. And every time you have to use semicolon. And what you do is you use whether you want the prompts on one side, middle or the other. So I'll put it in the middle and then save and download. And again, a couple of seconds and here you are. Each page will have a different prompt. And it can't be much longer than that, uh, obviously. I just um, let it short and sweet so that we go a bit quicker. And again, you can choose different templates. You can use all of these templates and you can add whatever prompts you want at the top. If we go back to the main menu and then we go to planners. Planners, I, I actually still use these ones and I find it very, very useful. There is one thing that uh, they don't have in here, which would be even more useful at this at a personal level which is um, these are, um, you have a day per page or you have a week per page. I actually like two, uh, one week for, in two pages, I spread out in two pages. Unfortunately, they don't have that, but that's personal preference again. And all you do is you go into one of them and trim size. And then you can add the range, the, the time that you want, and then, so say, as it is, it's less than like that, until the end of 2020. And you can do it in different languages as well, and you can have the, you can change the headers as well if you want to, you have your own headers, you want to put your own um, personal touch. You can have you can show the week numbers, the day, uh, you can uh, a date range or the month. So in here, that would be the date range, the week number and the date. Um, I don't usually use the date range. So if I remove that, if I switch it off, and I don't want the week number side, as you will see, it's disappeared from here. So that, I'm happy with that. It tells you the number of pages. Again, you can have bleed or no bleed. And that's it. What you do is save and download. Again, it takes a couple of seconds. You open up and you have a whole diary created for you already. Again, you can Upload this complete, uh, uh, straight to uh, Amazon KDP, or you can modify and add your own personal touches. You can perhaps add pictures to it if you want a floral, you want animals, pets, or anything that you, you would like to um, change in that. So, that is actually very much the, the very basics of. Uh, tangent templates. As I said, oh well, you have, sorry, I forgot this one's template packs. You can do a focus on education, so it's specific to mindfulness or paper games. So you can even create a whole book with, say, 10 pages of each of these, and then you have a full book to upload again in uh, on uh, Amazon KDP. Mindfulness, uh, you can use um, this course individually um, just to create a whole book of the same. Or uh, one of the things I do is I use some of these templates to add to my diaries. And um, so I put all the pages together on PowerPoint. I, I don't know why I started using PowerPoint, but I do. Uh, you can use Word, or you can use any other thing that. Um, you're familiar with. So that's what I do. I choose one or two. I have used this one, letting go of crit criticism uh, in my diaries and also the grounding yourself and the happy memory clouds. So I just uh, download them and I create, uh, I add them to my diaries. Um, and 
then you have, so for example, the education, you have uh, a bit more specific. So you have all the revision planners, semester overview, timetables, uh, grades. So you can also have them as a book by themselves, or you can add them uh, to your diary. So you could do um, a school diary and then add some of these templates and so you create a more specific one. Now, obviously there are loads more to this. Uh, I just want to keep the video as short as possible. You have an interior designer, although having said that, this is um, very basic. And then you have the tangent builder. And in here you can just create uh, like that and or you can load a previous PDF that you might have used. So, for example, you can do this and it comes up automatically. Um, the KDP <coughs> help hub is, is actually very useful because, so you say, <coughs> the comic book, I believe we did 80 pages. So, it was a paper, it's going to be paperback. Eight and a half by 11 inches, it was eight pages, white and um, say, lead, continue. And what it does, it actually tells you the, the sizes, the dimension for you, for your cover. And it creates a template as well that you can download and then use another program such as Canva or any other uh, um, image uh, designer program and you can upload it there. I actually have Canva and Affinity. Uh, I have Affinity Photos, so I could do it with that, but I, um, I, I actually use Canva. So I would basically go to Canva and uh, upload, create a new project with these measurements and which would be uh, these measurements in here and then I would upload this to have it as template and uh, then design with that um, underneath. Um, you have the list of helper in here so it can help you uh, listing on Amazon KDP and Category Explorer which it helps you if you want to know about uh, the school uh, diary. Okay, so you can print anything. Uh, with the browser. So in here, basically, is all the categories that you uh, that you can use on Amazon as well. So I think I'm going to leave it here for now because I don't want this to be uh, too long. But if uh, any of you watching this video, if it's been useful, please just. Uh, uh, like the video and subscribe if you're not subscribed to my video to my channel and please do leave messages if you would like me to do any more in depth with this uh, with tangent templates I will create another video in which I will explain a bit more and um, I will also upload a video showing you how to convert PDFs to other programs and uh, how to put all the pages together, even from two or three or more PDFs, so you can create a unique, um, very personal, uh, low-content book that you can sell on Amazon KDP. Thank you.